Hello everyone, I'm Ian Genius, and welcome back to part 4 of the shore. Let's jump right back into this living nightmare. If you remember last episode, we got chased by a bunch of things. Now we have a creepy pyramid, and are now dealing with these. We are now going to haunt my nightmares. Rawr. I hate them. I hate, 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 double hate, loathe entirely. Oop. I'm glad I figured out that I can lazy beam open the doors. Who's the crawling one? This? These? You back down. Oh. What? Over here, Andrew. What? You are aware of another voice. Ignore it. We are what is this? closer to achieving what we came for. <clears throat> Do not let the chasm of the void take you. Your daughter needs you to be strong now. I don't want to follow the disembodied masks. I don't know who's talking to me, who that is. I don't know what's going on. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my god, my what? hand's blue. What is happening to me? <laughs> it's not important. What's most Where am important I? is the exchange for coming this far. Your resilience of all of mind. Oh, it changed colors. It's extraordinary. Yes, wait, it's Ooh! What? Where? That? I'd rather not. I would follow the creepy mannequin face. Mannequin face. It's the theater face. It's the happy and glee and sorrow. <gasps> Can I just have a bird? Please let this work. Man. Seagulls are immortal. Okay. Hey, the thing I got moving came up over here. I don't know what that is. I don't know what this is. I don't know what anything is anymore. I, I feel like I should have went to the Oculus because I haven't seen it since. We hop up on here? No? Yes. Sure, put in the plutonium rods. Aha. Yes, I know what I did. I don't know what I did. Okay, after much running around in circles, we figured it out. We can click here. And it sticks it in his eye. And I'm guessing we make it have all of its eyes. And hopefully this, this, come on, do you not want an eyeball? There you go. This will be what lets, gets us the path forward. And that, the, my little, okay. We're just gonna keep doing this then. More eyeball power. Oh. oh, thanks. Thanks for the big one. We'll put the big one there. Yay! Okay, let's do the same thing to the other side. Ah, could have made that a little clearer. I was running all over the place. I was trying to put the little ball in the seagulls' nests, into the boats. I never, never would have thought. I mean, I say never. It wasn't obvious, which I guess is a good thing. You know, hunting for clues, but by God, that one was a beating. 
but we're making progress now. Towards what end? I don't know. That's not the question we're asking here. We're not asking about the the whys or the consequences. We're just doing the task of labor for it. Okay, that's all of those. Oh, I hear something charging up. But touch the spinning D20. Hopefully I don't roll a crit failure. Let's blast it. Oh, it go. Oh, it was mad. Oh, down cut out. Oh no, I've broken his spikes. Oh. No, I've, I've really set him free. I... No, stop. Stop, dodecahedron. I rolled the crit failure. I may have made an oopsie. Okay. No. Bad thing. Where are you going? Are you gonna go fight the pillar? <laughs> oh, he's gonna climb it? It's gonna go off with him. What is going on? Makes absolutely no sense. Okay, after multiple failed attempts, we blast this, we blast this, we blast this. That gives us this thing. We don't look at the boss, and we blast that. No? Yes. Well, we just gotta make sure we don't touch the boss. Ta-da, we did it, finally. Oh, this is worse. Why are they moving their jaws? What is this? No, what are you? Oh no, am I looking for your head? Is that it? Is that your head? No. How about you? Oh my god, am I looking for a head in a sea of heads? I think I see it. Do you guys see it? This one's got a glowy thing on his head. So surely... But, okay. Last of all. Yay, oh my god. It's been like five minutes looking for that stupid thing. All right, we are now in the wormy past. And another I um what the heck is that? Got a mouth in its chest. Can I blast it? Do I let sit on my head? How do I get one of your many forms? Oh. Aha. Does it change if I do that? Oh, we're just, I'm just blasting the ones that light up, apparently, and that was what to do. Awesome. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, no. Maybe Cthulhu is a good guy. Oh, oh no. Oh no, I, I don't, I don't slow it down. I do slow it down, okay. Run, dude. Through the door. Hurry. Ah, uh, he's coming. He ate me. All right, third time's the charm again, hopefully. I didn't even have this much trouble with the heads. But it's a manifestation of Cthulhu, so maybe that's their reason that this thing apparently seemingly teleports. Run! Quit stopping to admire the walls. Okay. I'm seeing some light over here. So we're gonna go this way. I think the doors are just like ways through. Am I just supposed to, you know, keep blasting away at them? There's no indication of where to go. I don't even know what I'm looking for. We'll go through this Cthulhu door. I'm not sure why it takes two blasts of the artifact either. Alright, there's another door. Oh, no. I don't have time to mess with you. We think we found the way. Show me the way. Show me the fuck. Oh, Lord. That is horrifying. But I think I found Cthulhu. Let's blast it. Oh, he's he's uh he's uh waking up. Cthulhu is in the moon. Hey buddy. gonna back away from that or not deal with him. <laughs> okay, we've made it back on the island apparently. So we're gonna go ahead and wrap up episode four of the shore there. If you like what you see, consider giving me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button really helps out me and the channel. If there's anything that I missed or you wanted to talk about, you know leave me a comment down below and I'll see you in the next one.